is such an emotional video i'm going to try and keep my cool and not cry because i don't like people see me cry it makes me vulnerable and i don't want to be vulnerable okay so i'm going to try and keep my cool hey darlings and welcome back to another video if you're new to my channel if this is the first time stumbling upon my channel i bless god for that and if you like what you see in this video go check out my other videos which i'll leave linked here and also up here somewhere and you would decide whether you want to subscribe or not i really hope that you subscribe and you stay and you join the family okay guys in today's video i'm going to be reacting to my first ever ever video here on youtube um uh, before i before i start reacting i feel like you guys deserve an explanation where have i been in the past two weeks two three weeks i think two weeks two weeks plus i have been resting basically i've just been taking a little time off away from filming and just relaxing on the 24th of june that was last week was my birthday and i just started to take a break and breathe a little and put my house in order and think and all of that so yeah that's where i've been so you're going to have bigger better content on this channel more informative cha content on this channel so if you have not subscribed i don't know what you're waiting for just click the subscribe button okay so guys yes i'm going to be reacting oh my god oh my god oh my god i've not seen this video in a while so i don't know what to expect look at how my green is so big I'm going to leave the video here so we can watch it together and react together. Okay. Guys, this is so emotional for me. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Okay. intro oh my god oh my god oh my god oh my god <laughs> i love this backpack i still have this backpack um Wow, this is so emotional for me, guys. I don't know. I feel like not even watching it anymore. Because if you guys don't know, my channel turned a year on the 1st of July. So this is like a year now of doing this and a year into clinical classes. So this is like super emotional for me right now. And this was a Monday. And normally on Mondays, we have like hematology, okay? So we have to go to the hospital because we might have like practicals and bedside teachings and all of that so this was hematology i was just packing my bag as a good student that i am oh my god let's keep watching <laughs> It was my friend that did this video for me. Hey, oh my god, guys. The bus we entered, like there's this bus that comes to pick us because we went we had not moved to our new hostel, so we were still in the old hostel because it was not a new school session. When we're done with our second MB, we don't really follow the school calendar when it comes to exam and all of that. But when it comes to like hostel application, we have to follow the school calendar. So we're done with our exams, and it was not a time for us to move. But there was a bus that always comes to pick us for a token of about 18 era to 120. The highest you can pay is 120. Okay, so 
yeah so this was the bus i entered see my roommate oh my, my roommate adana don't worry you're going to see her very soon on this channel i just want quarantine to be over we have a couple of videos to film we're going to be seeing her very soon on this channel yeah guys so let's just continue watching the video <laughs> <laughs> what was I doing? I was betraying trees. I'm building. Oh my god. I was still an amateur. Don't judge me. Yes, I was only five minutes late and I was so angry. I'll tell you a little story after this video is done about what happened this day. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Yes, it was the longest ride ever. Like, honestly, it was the long longest ride ever. I'm still videoing the road. I was so shy! Oh my god, I wanted to vlog this. I was preparing myself. Hold on. I was preparing myself. I swear, I was preparing myself of how I was going to talk when I come down from the bus and say, Okay, guys, we're in school now. And um, I'm about to enter the class. I'm a, bit, a little bit late. Uh, when I got out from the bus, my classmates were looking at me. I just, I just couldn't. Okay. I just couldn't make myself. I just decided to just. I was holding the camera like this, down like this, close to me. I was like, so guys, we got to school and we're going to class and <laughs> my god Okay, I know that my filming was kind of amateur, but you have to give me kudos for that my first video I actually edited it well, okay? So yes, yes. Let me give you a short story about what happened when we got to class. So this was our first day, okay? First ever day in clean in clinical classes and it was a monday and mondays we have hematology so when we got to class we were very late the, we, the, our class was for 8 30. normally we leave our hostels by 7 or 6 30 depending on if there's going to be hold up or not you just have to try and foresee things that will happen so we were late we, are, we came around either i think 10 Yes, we came around 10 and 10 is normally the time that we like take our breaks and all of that. So we came, we got there around 10, most of us. We didn't know. This was our first time ever. We didn't know that there was going to be traffic, but trust me, the traffic was very, very serious. So we didn't know that there was going to be traffic and we didn't really know how long it was going to take for us to get there. But when we got to the class, people that had like their own personal cars, and came from home or their parents drivers took them to school they came earlier than us like us when i mean us i mean people in the hostel okay so they came earlier than us and a lecture had already been like we we're supposed to have two classes between 8 30 to 10 8 30 to 9 30 9 30 to sorry 10 30 not 10 10 30 we came around 10 so the last class was like halfway done so I don't know and we have like our um the way we take attendance is by biometric so we turn print so it's not like you're signing attendance with turn print so the turn printing guy as we usually call him was there so people that had been there had already turn printed then the hod of um hematology department came in and was like she was so angry with us hey my god she instilled fear into her heart <laughs> she was like if you do not take this seriously how can you come for hey she was like no attendance for you guys today see if you want to play with us don't play with attendance don't even go close to you are not signing attendance sorry excuse me what, what exactly if you remove attendance from 
um, classes. I can count how many people will come to class. Even still with the attendance, people will do mathematics. I know because you need to have like seventy percent attendance before you sit for your um professional exams. Okay, so we need that seventy percent attendance, seventy five percent attendance. So some people will sit down and do calculation. Okay, I need to go for about. 50 days out of how many days now of class I just go for about 75 days in 100 days of classes I'm just as an example and the remaining 25 they're just going to chill and relax they cannot come back in their cell so if you want to say anything in medical school don't play with us with attendance because we're not going to take it and it's not the attendance that okay somebody will sign for you this one is your term you cannot cut off your term and do term parents it's not possible okay okay you need your term so yes she was like no attendance for you guys today hey i was like all of us were like this one don't know what we passed through we're on god the journey was a long one trust me a journey that is usually around 45 minutes give or take an hour was extremely long the hold up was mad it was a monday morning so you can only imagine so that was what happened that day so my classmates were not even happy but at the end of the day shasha we took our attendance and everything was fine so let's continue watching the video The noise was so much, you guys could have really hear me. Oh, this is my friend Favor. You guys have seen her on this channel a lot of times. This was the first time I've ever seen each other after like two weeks break. This was the first of July. <laughs> oh. The classmate they are meeting after the class oh my god what is that <laughs> but yeah guys look at us looking so clean and neat in our on our white and blacks oh my god this is so emotional god Yeah, I was still learning how to hold my camera very well, like face the place that had the sun. So this was actually very dark. Oh, 
That was an emotional throwback, guys. Oh my god, guys. I don't even. I'm just smiling because I really do not want to cry right now. I don't want to be vulnerable. But yeah, guys, that was so emotional for me. There are a lot of things that. It's over a year now. It's over a year that I started clinical class and it's over a year that I started YouTube which was the 1st of July so I'm so excited I'm so um, thrilled that this one year was a very beautiful year trust me for both clinical classes and starting YouTube and there's a lot that I, ha I have learned at, like within this one year that I cannot even take for granted at all when it comes to I'll start with YouTube first then I'll go to clinical classes when it comes to YouTube I knew quite a lot when it comes to because I always wanted to start a YouTube channel since 2016. You guys, if you've been following me on my channel here for a long time, you know this. I've always wanted to start YouTube since 2016. So I have been gathering the knowledge since I didn't have the morale to start. I have been gathering the knowledge and a lot of things I knew. You don't use copyright music and a lot of other things. And I was trying out my hands on editing apps and all of that, free editing apps, because I was not ready to. Um, start paying because I wasn't sure if like I would do well on YouTube if people would like me if people would like the kind of content that I put out if people would appreciate the kind of content that I put out so I was so worried starting YouTube I'll tell my sister that these people want to watch me like why would people want to watch me like what exactly what what good thing am I going to bring that would want like I would want them to watch me and I don't know what's this and I don't know, it was like me starting YouTube and coming this far and having so much people, so much subscribers and having this amount of views and your awesome comment is a very, um, it's a beautiful journey for me and um, I do not take it for granted. So there's a lot I've learned along the way that in YouTube to grow you have to be conscious. Then, yes, this is very true because anything that involves growth in this life, you have to be consistent, you have to consistently make yourself better, consistently be good at what you do. Okay, so that is one of the things that I've learned along the way, and I'm really trying to be consistent when it comes to um when it comes to being in clinical classes, it was a very emotional journey for me because guys i'm trying to hold back my emotions right now is a very emotional journey for me because before you get into clinical classes you have to pass you have to be done with preclinicals and to be done with preclinicals you have to have passed your second mb successfully there was a lot of higgy haggers on along the way but i am very grateful that i'm in clinical classes now and <laughs> don't worry guys 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 i really don't want to do this here on youtube i don't like being vulnerable in any way so i'm trying to hold back all my emotions right now as much as i can yeah guys it's really been very emotional to be here to start clinical class yeah there are a few things i wish i knew before clinical classes a video is going to be up very soon about things i wish i knew before medical school so do check out that video when it comes out so you would know and also a video about how clinical classes are so just prepare for that video and if you're not subscribed to the channel and you want to be in you want to know about that video just click the subscribe button and so you can get notified and i want to use this big this opportunity to say a very 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 huge thank you to everyone who has been on this journey 
with me from the very beginning along the way even right now i just want to say a very big thank you this one year will not have been a beautiful one year without you guys here with me to join me on this journey trust me this year would have just been a fail but you guys have been here with me and i have learned a lot along the way and i am grateful for that i am grateful for your consistency in viewing my videos i am grateful for your likes i am grateful for your comments and um yeah guys basically so this is the end of the video guys if you like this video please click the subscribe button and check out this video on this video okay so guys i will see you guys in my next one i love you bye guys